Princess leads the polo posse. Kate sips champagne and catches up with Peter Phillips and jockey Frankie Dettori as they cheer on Prince William in charity match. Kate Middleton got into the celebratory spirit today as she sipped on champagne and shared a laugh with Frankie Dettori and Peter Phillips while cheering on Prince William in a charity polo match. The Princess of Wales, 41, was supporting the Prince, 41, as he took part in the Outsourcing Inc. Royal Charity Polo Cup 2023 at the Guards Polo Club in Windsor. The royal mother of three opted for a £550 baby blue midi dress from designer Beulah London, for the occasion. The princess was quick to get into the swing of the event and could be seen throwing her hands into the air with glee as William competed in the charity event. Kate was beaming from ear to ear as the match got underway, while her husband rode across the grounds in front of a crowd including Peter and Frankie. During the outing, the princess appeared in high spirits and could be seen chatting with her husband and other attendees. It's likely the couple's children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis, did not join them at the event because it is still term time. At today's event, the princess wore her hair in loose waves across her shoulders and opted for neutral makeup, with a sweep of eyeliner and a touch of blusher. Kate has worn the London-based designer on a number of different occasions in the past. In fact, Beulah London, co-founded by Lady Natasha Rufus Isaacs and Lavinia Brennan in 2010, has become a go-to label for Kate. Just last week, the princess re-wore a two-year-old dress from the brand to head to the Young VA event in London. Meanwhile Prince William arrived in a blue shirt and smart grey blazer, before changing into his polo kit as he took to the field. Prince William previously played in charity polo matches with his brother Prince Harry, who now lives in his $14. 7 million home in Santa Barbara with wife Meghan Markle, son Archie, and daughter Lilibet Diana. The pair both competed in the Gerudong Trophy charity polo match together at Sirencester Park Polo Club in 2017. Prince Harry and William went head-to-head -head in the King Power Royal Charity Polo Day, held in honor of late Leicester City owner Wichai Siwat Naprapa on July 2019. The brothers were supported by the Duchess of Sussex, who was seen cradling baby Archie, and the princess, who brought along royal supporters Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis. Later on the Prince of Wales and his team went on to win the Kuhn Wichai Siwatanaprapa Memorial Polo Trophy at the Billing Bear Polo Club, holding up the Victory Cup for a photo. Last year, Kate cheered William on as he played in the Royal Charity Polo Cup 2022. And while the game Prince William took part in today was helping to raise funds and awareness for charities supported by the couple, 
Prince Harry has also taken to playing polo across the pond. Last year, he was competing in the Pacific Coast Circuit Inter-Circuit Cup, which was founded by Nacho Figueras, 45, an Argentine polo professional and model, and longtime friend of the Prince. And Megan was there to watch every game from the sidelines. Today is likely to be a more low-key appearance from the Princess, who yesterday joined William for his father's Scottish coronation in Edinburgh. Cheeky Kate gave Prince William a gentle tap on the behind in a rare public display of affection yesterday as they joined Charles and Camilla for the event. The princess joined other senior royals including her husband the prince and Charles and Camilla for a regal procession through Edinburgh. She and Prince William joined Camilla to watch on as Charles was presented with the Crown of Scotland during his Scottish coronation at St Giles Cathedral in Edinburgh. The ceremony at St Giles Cathedral was a key part of Royal Week, with Charles and Camilla undertaking several engagements in Scotland. And despite the formality of the occasion, it appeared Kate was in a playful mood, at one point in the service, tapping her husband gently on the behind. It's a move Kate has been seeing performing a number of times in the past few months, and continues to be a rare public display of affection for the couple. She playfully tapped him on the behind during their day at the Royal Ascot last month, and also sent royal fans wild when she performed the same gesture on the red carpet at the BAFTAs in February. The royal mother of three looked regal in the bespoke Catherine Walker coat dress, which she has worn on a number of occasions in the past, as she joined other senior royals for a regal procession through the city. The design features incredibly neat tailoring, a longer length and a luxe velvet collar. Meanwhile earlier this week, she attended Wimbledon for a special ceremony to honor her close friend Roger Federer. The princess was among those enthusiastically applauding as Federer was honored for his stellar sporting achievements on center court following his retirement from the game last year. Meanwhile his wife Mirka watched on in the royal box, where other guests included Prince Michael of Kent and his daughter Lady Gabriella and former Prime Minister David Cameron and his wife Samantha. The princess, who has been patron of the All England Lawn Tennis Club since 2016 looked elegant as she arrived at the All England Club wearing a smart pleated white skirt and mint £1,950 Balmain blazer. It's unlikely the appearance will be Kate's only visit to the tournament this year, the royal is known to be an avid fan. The family even have a court at their country home, Anmer Hall in Norfolk. Last year, she and Prince William were joined by their son Prince George for the event. 